For there to be a football season this year, many things must fall into place. Today, Lamar University took a big first step with players reporting. Over 80 athletes in all were screened for COVID-19 this morning. It's all part of what has become the new norm during this global pandemic. Players will now be quarantined for a day or two before undergoing physicals. We have everything in place from the social distancing um, to everything being sanitized. We, we've got everything kind of, it's a working document, but from a strength perspective, from our practice perspective, and then from our building perspective, we've got you know, we've got everything in place right now and we'll continue to update it, you know, so that for, first and foremost, our guys are safe. You know, we want them to be safe and we don't want to, you know, we don't want to spread uh, the virus at all. Um, and then we want to get to September 3rd. Uh, every day they'll have to come in and get screened, um, take the temperature um, and, and answer a questionnaire every day. So they'll get a little, little redundant after a while, but it's important to, to get to know that. So, so we're self-screening and if someone pops up uh, with symptoms, we'll be testing them for COVID at that point. And um, if you walk through our facilities, we got hand sanitizers everywhere. We got sort of a one-way flow. Um, make sure people don't interact with one another and, and as much as possible and uh, keep the social distance. We are requiring everybody to wear a mask. That's what I'm doing today. And um, except for workouts, for workouts, we'll, we'll, if the student athlete wants to wear a mask, we'll let them do it. But most likely that's not gonna happen, which is okay. We had a team meeting over, via Zoom. I said, we got, you know, in order to get to September 3rd, we've got to practice, you know, all these things that, that we need to practice in order to keep, you know, from spreading the virus. 